Well, hello, my YouTube family. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Or Happy New Year's Eve or, you know, whatever the hell you want to call it. Just, just Happy New Year. It is Tuesday, the last Tuesday of the year. It is December 31st, 2013, the last date of the year of 2013. Good riddance. That's all I have to say. The last three months were harsh, people. The last three months, October, November, December, were a little harsh for me. The rest of the year was pretty okay. I couldn't complain. But uh, October, November, December, y'all need to get the hell away from me. Okay, people. So, I've got things to talk about. Haulage has arrived. So, sit down, get a cup of coffee, get some snacks, popcorn, chips, whatever is your... You know, whatever is your poison, um, just relax, put your feet up, um, get all nice and comfy cozy because uh, the blush haulage has propelled and there's still more to come. So, you know, oh, but I do need to tell you a couple of empties. Um, my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish has bit the dust out for 2013. This is the last of it. I know I could still probably... But, you know, I want to start something new, start 2014 on something new, which I really don't even know what it is that I'm going to start. But I have some powders in there. So there you go. Bye bye. Mac mineralized skin finish in medium deep. I thought I'd never finish this, but there it is. Bye bye. I don't even remember when I bought this. It could have been 2010 or whatever. I don't. That one's bye-bye. And so is this. My CoverGirl Olay um, Concealer. Concealer Balm. This served me well, people. It served me well. It did my under eyes. Made them just a little bit more brighter. So I have other concealers waiting in the wings. So that, too, is an empty. So there you, there you go. Um, finished products, empties, whatever the heck you want to call them. That is it. Now, can we get to these puppies? Of course we can. This is a combo, people. This is the last combo of 2013. And here is the combo. This and uh, this. Perfect. Together. This is the Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in Shameless. This is fantastic. This is fantastic. What? What did you say? What did you say? What? Fan freaking tastic. This is amazing. This is amazing. Love, 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 love. Then to put it as a topper, which actually this can be worn by itself because it is thick enough. But you know what? I'm going to put some more because this. The formula, I don't know. Oh, it's so smooth. Oh, and it all, almost has like a chocolatey scent. A chocolate caramel mint kind of a scent. Very pleasant. No taste, but the, the scent is rather nice. This is the Maybelline Elixir in Vision in Violet. Oh, precious, precious, precious. Yes, yes, I almost forgot to swatch, but here it is, people. Here it is. There. That is Vision in Violet on top of Shameless. Oh, and you get this to match my headband, of course. Yes. Both are fantastic. Absolutely magnificent. That's all I have to say. Revlon, Maybelline, perfect partners in crime, let me tell you. So that is the last lip combo of the year. Go figure. Now, Sarah tried to, um, yeah, Sarah, you know I love you, girl. You know I do. I really, really do. She tried to um, enable me to go to a drugstore you know, to pick up my last final things because there are new things coming out. Well, I went to the drugstore because I had to go to the drugstore to pick up my prescription. 
Went to Dwayne Reed. Dwayne Reed does not have anything new out. I was so disappointed. You just don't know. Because I really was ready. I was like, well, you know, Sarah's right. This is the this is the last of the Mohicans, people. This is it. I am in for the duration, which means that is all. That's it. Whatever I ordered was the last order. And I was even going to kind of bend my re my resolution and say, well, maybe I shouldn't order anymore until my birthday. And maybe I'll just give myself free reign to go into the drugstores instead and pay cash only. Oh, there he go. He just jumped right off. That's the heat that he likes to sit on top of. And uh, I guess his butt got a little too hot. So now I don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. <laughs> there he is right next to me. Hmm. There we go. That's my precious. He's lying down right next to me. Hello, my sweetheart. Oh, love him so. So anyway, um, so Sarah, your plan uh was was not did not it did not fly. I wanted it to fly because I went to the Dwayne Reed, I picked up my prescription, and then I walked around the cosmetic section. Not a damn thing, not a new um you know, a new, how do you call them? The, you know, uh, pop-up things. It's a proof of purchase kind of, you know, yeah. New displays. That's the word I was looking for. Display. New displays. None. Not a damn one. And, of course, I could have gone to the um, Rite Aid, which was right next door, but my back was hurting. And even though they let us out early at 3, the traffic was a bitch. And I had to go pick up gas. So I came home a lot later. It's, it's right, well, right now it's 4.54, but I came home at 4. So, and I spoke to Pop for a little bit. And, um, you know, it's sort of kind of snowing and like little itty bitty flakes right now. But they are talking about a clipper that is heading our way, honey. Thursday night into Friday. Those are the two days I have to go back to work. So, maybe Friday. If we're lucky, we'll, the office will be closed and we won't be able to come in. We shall see because it's going to start Thursday night, which of course means I, st I still have to go to work on Thursday. But if it's just one more day, hey, and if the snow comes a little earlier than Thursday night, like say, oh, I don't know, Thursday afternoon where they can just close the office early again, I'd be ever so grateful. But I'm not going to push it because I do have tomorrow off. So, well, it's January 1st. Everybody has tomorrow off. But you know what I mean. It's always fun to have off when the office is supposed to be open, you know. So, we shall see. We shall see. They're talking about it, but, you know. I mean, but they're really talking about it. Now, when they talk about it, the way they're talking about it, something big is going to happen. But sometimes, you know, they blow it out of proportion and, like, Long Island will have the big stuff and Queens won't have nothing, which means Queens chicks and men have to get to the office while the Long Islanders, oh, I can't come in. I'm snowed in and this, this and that. They always have that to fall back on, those Long Islanders. So whatever, whatever. Because if enough people don't come in the office during a snow day, I'm sure they will close the office. So we shall see. He's playing with one of his game things. Lord, please don't. Please don't mess with me. No, no. He likes to go under my legs for some reason. Anyway, so that is that with that upon that. Okay, let me wipe this off because my hand is going to be Swatch City. Swatch City. Swatch City. And he's kind of staying a little bit. Just a little bit. So here we go. Here we go. Be prepared, people. I put everything in one bag. Look at this madness. Look at this madness. These are all my Coastal Scents blushes, plus two of my Victoria's Secret blushes, plus my Lorac Hollywood blush. And there's still some to come. And can I tell you, I was very disappointed because there was a package that came today, which was supposed to be my Victoria's Secret blush in At Last. They sent me the wrong blush. They sent me Meetup again. 
But this is meetup. I have meetup already. So why are you sending me two meetups? No, no. I ordered at last. And you sent me meetup. So. so we shall see, people. If the person wants me to return it, whatever the case may be, because I will keep it. I'll keep it. I may even give it away. I don't know, but I'll just see what the other person tells me. So let's get on with it, shall we? Okay, let us work with the Lorac blush, the Baked Matte Satin Blush in Hollywood. Now, I already looked at these and I already swatched them. I was having myself a good old time when all of these came. Yes, Lord Jesus. Oh, and can I tell you, I have my eyeshadow on. It's my cover girl, and um, this one is called, oh, what's it called? Purple, purple pop, purple pop. There you go. It looks brighter in person, but then when you put it on, it's not really all that bright. I'm looking for a super bright purple. I'll look for it. You know, the blackest of the black eyeliner and the brightest of the bright, the hot bright purple that's what i'm looking for anyway this is the lorac blush in hollywood this is it people oh look at that is that not gorgeous look at it oh perfection people perfection sheer perfection okay so i and i swatched it already and this swatches like a rose gold. Yes, it does. I will show you. Look at that. Sheer perfection, people. Shit, look at it. Look at it. Oh. What? This is going to look fabulous on me, if I may say so my own damn self. And I have to have this close by because I'm going to be swatching a lot. A lot. So this is this. This is fabulous, people. This bag needs to stay put. This is Hollywood Lorac Matte. Thank God it's a matte. Baked Matte Satin Blush in Hollywood. Yes. Okay, so we have to put that one back. I don't have enough room, people. I do not have enough room. Oh, and by the way, I don't know if I told everybody, because everybody was asking, well, a lot of people were asking me yesterday, did I ever mention the results of my x-ray? I'm sorry. I, I thought I did in my last video, two videos back. Maybe I didn't. I'm so sorry, but I wanted to let you know that my x-ray came out as you know some some long name but what it really is is I am suffering from like moderate I can't say well, it's, it's almost moderate almost severe arthritis in my lower backbone you know right where the crack of the butt is that bone right there that's where the arthritis is kicking in so it could affect my leg so maybe the um, neurologist, when I go see him on the, on the 8th, will put that into consideration. So we shall see. We shall see. So that is the result. That is the result. I have a case of arthritis. 49 people. I wasn't expecting it so soon, but nevertheless, we are here. We are at the old age home, okay? We are at the old age home. Okay, let me just put this, because it's really bothering me now. Oh, Lord, I can't even. Okay, there we go. All right, so the next blush is one of the Victoria's Secrets blushes. And sorry for the glare, people. This one is in makeup. I mean... Meet up. I keep calling it makeup. Meet up. And let me take it out so I can show you. 
Victoria's Secrets make it's called Victoria's Secrets makeup, but the name of the color is Meet Up. And it is a kind of like a, a bright pink and a dark pink. Pretty much. I will swatch both separately and then swatch them together. Let's do the light side first. Sort of very, very light. That's it right there. It's like a super light baby pink. And then the dark side, the dark side, is this right here. And that's it right there. And then together, you get this right here. That well, you know, I swipe I swiped it this way. I didn't want to swipe it this way, so I swiped it down the middle. So of course it looks like it's down the middle. So you get both, but if you blend them, it comes out to be like a nice like a pale plum, mauve plum something somewhere around there. Very nice. That's all I have to say. Meet up Victoria's Secrets blush. It's a blush duo. Yes, people, that is Meet Up. The next one is also a Victoria's Secrets blush duo. And this one is in Swoon. And it doesn't look like it's a duo, but it is. This one is very light. There we go. There we go. There you can see it. Kind of like a peach and a tan, a peach, and a kind of like a a goldy beige. God, it's gorgeous. Okay, I'm gonna have to um, undo my shirt sleeve because I see this is going to take up my entire arm. Okay, let's do the goldy side first. And it's sort of powdery, sort of powdery. Yeah, it's very peachy. It's very peachy. Light and very peachy. And then we're going to do the very light pink side. There it is. Very powdery. Very, very powdery. And there is that. See, it's very powdery. Chalky powdery. And then down the middle. It's like both sides together. Oh, this one came out a little better blended. And there you have that. Can't really see much, people. But when I wear them on my cheeks, I will let you know. I will let you know. Okay. I'll, I'll, I always, I think yesterday I forgot. My bad. But I will write, you know, I usually write face and then what I'm, I'm wearing. Well, with these new ones, I'll definitely have to let you know. So this Victoria's Secret is called Swoon. Yes, people. Okay. Next. Now we are going into the Coastal Scents blushes, people. Coastal Scents. See, I didn't forget it this time. Coastal Scents. These are just as pigmented as sleek blushes. Just letting y'all know right now. Just as pigmented, okay? Like, seriously. So this is the packaging. Very cute. Oh, my goodness. And they show you what the color is in the back. This one's passionate. Forever blush passionate. I love the packaging. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And they show you the back. Forever Blush Passionate. And they give you all the ingredients. And it has a little mirror on the top. And this is Passionate. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Okay, I'm going to have to... Um, 
wipe off my fingers. Okay, here we go. Passionate. These are super pigmented. Pigmented, okay? Passionate. Right there. Right there. That is passionate. It's like a brick red. Not even. Mulberry red. That's how I would call it. Kind of like a mulberry red. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. Next. Next is, see they all have the same packaging. Next is exquisite. And in D do it is exquisite, honey. Oh, these blushes are the ish. Y'all need to run, not walk, to the Coastal Sense site. Trust and believe. This is exquisite. It's kind of a little redder than um, the first one that I had, Passionate. This one is a little redder. It's kind of like a scarlet. Very nice. Woo, very nice. Okay, here we go. This is scarlet. I don't want to do this because, you know, that's the finger. So this was glam. This was um, passionate. This was passionate. This one over here is, um, what's this one called? Exquisite. This one right here is exquisite. And it is indeed do exquisite indeed. There it is. See, it's a little redder. It's a little brighter red. Pigmented people. Light touch. Unless you want to walk out like a clown. Pigmented. I'm just letting y'all know. So that is exquisite. Okay, next. I told you. Remember, I told you how many I ordered. Two, four, six, eight. Eight. Told you I ordered a lot. Uh, this one is graceful. Let's see what graceful is all about. This is graceful. Graceful kind of looks a little bit like exquisite. Okay. But I think, if I'm not mistaken, graceful is the dupe for the Tarte Blush Flush. I think, I think, I think. But now that I have the Tarte Flush, well, it didn't arrive yet, but, you know, now that I have it because it's on its way, I'll have two. Because this is, it's like a pinky red. Pinky red, yeah. It looks... Pretty similar to Exquisite. Well, let's do a dupe. No, let's do a dupe. Let's do a swatch. And there it is. It's a little lighter. Just, okay, let me see if I could. It's a little lighter. Just a little bit lighter. Let me see if I could do a darker swatch. There we go. That is it. That is it. Lovely. That was graceful. I hope I'm not boring you because this is going to, it's going to take a while. It's going to take a while. Next, alluring. Alluring. They're all in the similar, I just realized they're pretty much all look alike. This is a bright magenta. Oh, hell to the yeah. Bright magenta. This may be the dupe for flush. I don't know. Well, when flush arrives, I'll see which one actually looks like it. Okay, here we go. Ooh, ah. Uh, Woofa. Yeah. That one is a bright magenta. For sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Bright ass magenta. That would be that one. 
Yes, indeed you do. That is alluring. That is alluring. And it is alluring indeed. Light touch, people. Light touch. Okay? All right. Next. Mm, 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 mm. This is a shame. You know I'm never going to use all of these before my death, right? Next one is Royal. And you know I can't stand that song, Royals. <laughs> Royals. I can't stand that song. I used to like it when it first started, and then they just kept playing it over and over, and I can't stand it anymore. Can't. I? If I never hear it again, it'll be too soon. Okay, this is Royal. This is Royal. This one has a touch of brown in it. This is kind of like a mauve. A mauve on the brown side. There we go. That is royal. And it's still got a touch of red to it, though. Oh, shoot. I didn't put it far enough. Okay. Here we go. There it is. That is royal. It's got a touch of brown in it. Very nice. They are all nice. They are all nice. They are all very nice. So that's royal. Next. I'm going to have to take a bath after all of this. Jesus. Okay. The next one is glamorous. Ew. And it looks glamorous indeed. Yeah, this one has a touch of plum to it. And it's got shimmer. It's a little shimmery and it's plummy. Yeah, shimmery and plummy. So. It's a little plummy. There it is right there. I'm trying to move them over a little. It's Morvy Plum. It's kind of like a Morvy Plum. And as heavy as the swatch is on my arm, it doesn't come across on the screen so much. But there we go. That is glamorous. I like glamorous a lot. But you know, it's like trying to pick out your favorite child. <laughs> Impossible. Impossible. Okay. All right. Hold on, people. Hold the phone. Okay, here we go. Two left. Two left. Hang in there with me. This one. Okay, I don't want to do that one. I don't want to do that one last. This one is lovely. It's like a peachy. No, it's kind of like an orangey red. I can't, it's an orangey pink or something. There you go. It's got a touch of orange in there. Just a hint. Just a hint of like a, a mandarin. It could be like a mandarin pink or a mandarin red. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. Here it is. Very bright, kind of a, like a mandarin-ish. I'm hoping this will come through. There we go. Like a mandarinish peach, orange coral. It's all in there. Like an, it's like a coral. It's like a dark coral. On the peachy orange side. Very very nice. This one is called Lovely, and it is lovely indeed. The last one I saved last on purpose because it is. And it is what I consider a kind of like rose goldy, more on the goldy side. So here it is. It's called Dashing. And it is the lightest of the bunch because it's almost, it's, it's, sh is it shimmery? Yes. It's a shimmery beigey gold. 
it is very very nice shimmery beigey gold that's why I wanted to save it for last because all the other ones are more on the reddish and this one kind of stands out on its own it's called the dashing and let me rub dashing there it is right there there is dashing it's got a little a, a touch of shimmer very kind of goldish brown there it is a goldish brown that's it a goldish beige or a goldish brown or a goldish tan it's in that gold family lovely and that's the last of it people that's dashing dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh there we go people so that's it half an hour going into half an hour in a minute or so I love you I love my YouTube family let me know what you think about my swatches <laughs> good lord if you can remember all of them there we go yeah I'm really gonna have to wash this arm and that's it people happy new year have a safe healthy happy one let it be better for each and every one of us. Um, you know I'm looking forward to better health, right? I'm definitely looking forward to that. And I'm eating the way I should, so I'm not feeling guilty about that. Um, if I didn't like lettuce and tomato before, I'm learning to like lettuce and tomato now, okay? Lettuce and tomato, salad, lettuce and tomato, this. Something with lettuce and tomato. Um, chicken salad with lettuce and tomato chicken salad salad you know like a salad of lettuce with chicken salad tomato um grilled chicken wrap with lettuce and tomato turkey and swiss lettuce and tomato i'm not happy with my lunches but if it's going to help me get to a better place then i'll suck it up like i'm doing and i will just do what i have to do in the meantime, I want you all to be safe, happy, healthy. I love each and every one of you. I am going to be out tomorrow. I mean, out like you're not going to see me tomorrow. I'm not going out anywhere. Tomorrow, the Christmas tree goes down. Uh, everything gets packed up, holiday-esque. We starting fresh. On New Year's Day, that's what my mom used to do. On New Year's Day, we would watch the Rose Bowl Parade, and during the commercials, we'd take ornaments and stuff and put them back in their boxes and stuff. Well, I have a fiber optic tree, a little miniature fiber optic tree in the living room. So all I have to do is unplug it, put the, the, the branches back up, slide it back into the box, done. I don't have to worry about ornaments. I don't have to worry about none of that. So there you have it. That is it for me. I will be watching my Rose Bowl Parade tomorrow, enjoying each and every float, remembering me and my mom, maybe tearing up a little bit. And um, that's it. And Pop will, you know, he'll be home early in the morning. But yes, he will be going to work at night. And that's just that with that. So I love you. But he will be home in time for New Year's. So that's a good thing. He won't be at work. He will be home so we could say Happy New Year together and stand out in front of the house. I think we did this last year. We stood out in front of the house and we just shouted, Happy New Year! And voices from all around would just say, Happy New Year to you! And then cars honking and, and whistles are blowing and and then we go to bed. So that will be that with that upon that. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think about my lips. Let me know what you think about my batch of blushes. Needless to say, I'm, I'm not sweating blushes anymore. That has died down. That craving is gone <sighs> until something else pops up. In the meantime, uh, something else better not pop up because I'm not ordering a damn thing. I'm not buying anything. Love you. Love my YouTube family. I will see you next year. I love you one and all. Bye now. <laughs>